My name is Marina. I'm 39 years old. Uh, I'm a midwife on board. It's been eight years I've been working on the ship. On the ship, I think this is the only place in the world that you see so much nationality living together, doing something together. And this spirit or energy you will never be able to experience in my life back home. When I'm at home, uh, I work uh, as a midwife, also as a nurse in the hospital and clinic. I also studied a job uh, in a hotline center, so I also see a lot of uh, women suffering with uh, domestic violence, sexual violence, like uh, people like here. Uh, so the last rescue, we had 22 women, one child and one puppy. The rescue went okay. There was uh, one minor with uh, one baby. So she's just 17 and traveling uh, with a one-year-old baby. I just gave her uh, winter clothes because uh, it was very cold. Yeah, I gave her a, a small Vespa. The motorcycle. I think she really enjoyed this best part. Uh, and she was also interacting a lot with the puppy inside of the shelter. It was really nice to see. I think she, for her age, she doesn't talk a lot because she doesn't go to, she never been to any kindergarten or crush and she never interact with other kids same as her. So it's very common and uh, common in children on board especially coming from detention center of Libya. Children, they don't talk a lot because they are told to be quiet and they don't have opportunity to develop a lot of vocabularies and interactions with others. And I hope after reception center, they get uh, appropriate care as a minor and uh, a baby. Yeah. I enjoy the moment that when people are singing and dancing, they get dignity back after one or two days on board because finally they are called by name, not a number in the detention center. They are allowed to be themselves, express their joy with the music and in, in their own language. Yeah, I don't know where those energy come from. If I have the same experience as we did, I'm really always touched when I see it.